I think there must be something wrong with me, Linus. Christmas is coming, but I'm not happy. I don't feel the way I'm supposed to feel. Just don't understand Christmas, I guess. I like getting presents and sending Christmas cards, decorating Christmas trees and all that. I'm still not happy. I always end up feeling depressed. Whoa, in there! Rats! Nobody sent me a Christmas card today. I almost wish there weren't a holiday season. I know nobody likes me. Why do we have to have a holiday season to emphasize it? What's going on here? What's this? Find the true meaning of Christmas when money, money, money. Spectacular, super colossal neighborhood Christmas lights and display contest? Lights and display contest? Oh no. My own doggone commercial. I can't stand it. Ugh. <sighs> Thanks, old pal. Oh, brother. I don't mind your dishonesty half as much as I mind your opinion of me. You must think I'm stupid. You just want me to come running up to kick that ball so you can pull it away and see me land flat on my back and kill myself. It's a signed document. I guess if you have a signed document in your possession, you can't go wrong. This year, I'm really going to kick that football. Ah! I can't believe it. She must think I'm the most stupid person alive. Peppermint Patty's coming to Thanksgiving dinner. How do I always get into these things? Now she's bringing Marcy, too. I think I'm losing control of the whole world. Peppermint Patty's invited herself, Marcy, and Franklin over for Thanksgiving dinner. And I'm not going to be home. I'm going to be at my grandmother's. You can't explain anything to Peppermint Patty because you never get to say anything. I'm doomed. Three guests for Thanksgiving and I'm not even going to be home. Peppermint Patty will hate me for the rest of my life. No, not quite. That's the one. Whoa. I got my kite. Today's the day. I can feel it. Snoopy, why is it that everything I try turns out wrong? Sometimes I wonder if the kids really like me. Maybe that new kid will see me for who I really am. Like you. A dog doesn't try to give advice or judge you. They just love you for who you are. It's nice to have someone who that will just sit down and listen to you. <sighs> Man's best friend. Have you ever had that feeling when you can't stop smiling? Your heart pounds inside your chest. You try to stand, but your knees become weak. And then that little red-haired girl glances at you, and all of life's possibilities become so clear. And then you realize she has no idea you're alive. Why am I here? Because I just came down with a serious case of inadequacy. I need your advice on girls, Lucy. You're a girl, right? Let's just say there's this girl I like to impress. But she's something, and I'm nothing. If I were something and she was nothing, I'd talk to her. Or if she was nothing and I was nothing, I'd talk to her. But she's something, and I'm nothing. So I just can't talk to her. Before you leave, there's something I really need to know. Why, out of all the kids in our class, would you want to be partners with me?